takes care of me to make sure I will, to make sure I am healthy. Yeah, real. <laughs> and and that because he he takes care of me and my sister. Sometimes he come over, come over our house to check we're okay. That's all. <laughs> I thank you for my mom because she always go out of her way to get what I want and need, even if she couldn't afford to give me. And I love her for that. I'm thankful for my family. I'm thankful for my friends because they keep me happy. I'm thankful for school because some, in some places, women aren't allowed to get education. And I'm thankful mm. to be able to. I'm thankful for the clothes and shoes and the food and the roof over my head because I could be on the streets with no clothes or food and no shelter. Uh, I'm thankful for my parents, for them providing everything that I need, even when I'm not going to get out this morning. And I'm thankful for, I'm thankful for my nana for always praying for me and making sure that I'm okay. I'm thankful for my mom for always checking in on me, even though I don't call her as much as I should. And I'm thankful for my sisters for always being my backbone. And this helped me out through everything, and you know, just thankful for my family and God. I am thankful for another day. I am thankful that I have my health. I'm thankful for my family, of course, for putting up with my emotional self. I am thankful for dance and being able to express myself to dance in ways that people express themselves through other things. It just fulfills a certain need that some people aren't able to fulfill or don't know what they need. And I'm glad that that's clear to me that it just stands through God. I just, I'm thankful that I have healthy ankles and that no matter how much I hurt myself or sprain my ankle or my knees or bruise myself, that I'm a better dancer because of it today. And yeah. <laughs> I'm thankful for friends, family, and food, of course. God and life, what kind of food you ask? Like grease, beans, potatoes, corn, and I'm thankful for my mother and Mr. Richard. I'm thankful for Mr. Richard um, helping me to get closer with God. Um, throughout everything and always saying yes when my mom says no. <laughs> and, um, I'm thankful for my Nana because she's always been there for me and she's always spoiled me and she's always helped me become closer to God. I'm thankful for my aunt and London because they are always just keeping me on track with everything I need to do and she's always there to help me throughout everything. And I'm thankful for my sister because even though I and I make her probably the maddest she's ever been. She's still there for me. She never gives up on me. And I'm thankful for my brother because even though we fight a lot, we're always going to stay close. Yeah. <laughs> so I am thankful for the beautiful life that I live now. I'm also thankful for the parents that help guide me through life and help me make wise decisions when I know that I'm probably going to choose the wrong anyway. I am thankful for being able to wake up in the morning to see the ones that I love and to see the ones that keep me on my toes. I am thankful for God giving me the chance to build my strength to be a, become a better person. And I am thankful for my family and I am thankful for the things that are around me and the air that I breathe and the food that comes to my mouth every morning and every day. I'm thankful for the clothes that are on my back because people struggle out there and I realize that people struggle and sometimes we just sit there and we watch them struggle thinking well thank god I don't have to do with that well maybe we should make a change you know mm -hmm. and try to help them out and make them a better person just how you become a better person every day with the decisions that you make you know and I believe that dance is an amazing stress reliever. And singing is an amazing stress reliever. And believing in God 
is the best painkiller that anyone could ever have. And I've realized that. I haven't been getting closer with God because I've been so busy with other things, but now I realize maybe I should put things aside. Maybe I should put everything aside and become closer to Him because He's the main reason why everything is happening in my life. He's the main reason why I wake up every morning. He's the main reason that gets me thinking, you know, when math is hard and if I'm taking that big old test and I know not one question on there and I just ask God, hey God, I'm gonna need your help. <laughs> You're my only guide towards this test. So, other things can stress you. Tons of things can stress you. Sisters, brothers, siblings, family, outside things from school, school. <laughs> But just know that when you are stressful or when you are in pain or when you really need to think about what your true or what your true meaning in, in life is in life, just think about God. I'm thankful for God because he's the only person that would bring you guys into my life. And he's the only person that would make me realize, hey, this is your family. This is the people that love you and the people that you love. So those who keep you on your toes, you love them as well. Because if you didn't, you wouldn't let them keep you on your toes. Stress is somewhat healthy, but then again, it's not when you're putting too much on your mind. So let it, let God ease your mind. Let him show you the things that you should be thankful for, or the things that other people aren't having that you should be thankful for for having. So I'm thankful for you guys. And I'm thankful for God. And I'm thankful for food, of course. Flow. <laughs> so, just be thankful for what you have and accept what you have because others might not have it. And God may show you that it's not what you need. It's what they want. It's what the devil wants. He wants you to need him to be coming to your life and to ruin your life. Don't let that happen. You need God. You don't want him, you need him. There's no there's no other way. There's no other words to describe him. So appreciate what you have. Know what you have and realize it. Because you could be gone tomorrow. There is no promise for another day. Thank you. Wow.